Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, we're going to the beach tomorrow, planning some fog at least early in the morning. We're starting to see that form along the coastline already. A look back at this afternoon, just spectacular high temps today, topping out low in mid 70s, including 71 Providence and low to mid 60s along the coastline. We should reach at least 70 tomorrow afternoon away from the ocean. The dense fog advisory has been extended further um, west to include Bristol County, Mass. Does not include Rhode Island, does not include our South Shore. However, we're not surprised me along our own coastal waters here in Rhode Island for some pretty dense fog as well. But for now, the dense fog advisory for southeastern Massachusetts only. But you see the visibility coming down a little bit down at Easton's Beach in Newport. It's not real thick yet, but I do anticipate uh, the visibility to go down even more in places like uh, Newport. Warwick now coming in at 57, so a cool to mild night. You can see uh, some low cloudiness on the uh, satellite photo. It'll be widening out the view. There's actually a little storm system offshore. That's going to peel away away from us, but that will keep things dry in terms of uh, any steady rain tracking a cold front. You see it right in here out ahead of it. I have the lightning tracker turned on lightning strikes across the Great Lakes. This front will approach tomorrow evening around six, seven, eight o'clock in the evening, and it may produce a scattered shower, but better part of the daylight hours of a Thursday is actually dry. The forecast shows this well. We'll walk you through it hour by hour. Find the spot you're interested in. Watch the time bar right up in here. and Let's set this into motion. And you can see the gray, the low clouds and fog overnight early tomorrow morning, 6 a.m. mid 50s. We'll start to thin this out, burn it off some sunshine by one o'clock in the afternoon. Notice that the temperature set up. It's been like this now for the last several days. Warmest weather inland, low 70s and 60s along the coastline. Three o'clock in the afternoon, a mix of clouds and some sunshine. Uh, six o'clock in the evening, we're doing fine outdoor activities. It looks pretty good. Notice out towards Connecticut, you see a few showers. This is around eight o'clock in the evening. So around seven, eight o'clock around sunset, a couple of isolated showers. These are more of a nuisance than anything else. I mean, it's nothing that would last very long if you catch one, but the chance is there tomorrow evening. Tomorrow morning, waking up to fog, mainly near the coastline, the lower part of the bay, otherwise becoming mostly sunny, starting off in the 50s, and then during the afternoon, I was looking at a cloud-sun mixture, though tending towards extra clouds later in the afternoon, uh, upper 60s to around 70 for the afternoon high temp. Friday, I like it. <laughs> Sunshine. Temperatures in the upper 60s. Looks like a pretty good day uh, early in the morning, starting off in the uh, mid 50s uh, by noontime. Upper 60s around 68, 69 degrees with a mix of clouds and sunshine. So overall Friday looking OK. Unfortunately, feeling more pessimistic about uh, Saturday's forecast. Clouds and showers cooler on, on Saturday. Mother's Day Sunday uh, at this point. Not perfect, but not a total loss. The early thinking on this is that we get some showers early in the morning and then a drying trend with some partial sunshine during the afternoon. That may help the temperatures get up into the upper 60s to around 70. You've been trying to nail down the timing on this, and right now we're thinking that Saturday probably the wetter day with some improvement by Mother's Day Sunday afternoon with a high temperature near 70. Still check back with us. You got another update uh, tonight at 11 o'clock, and meteorologist Michelle Muscatello in early tomorrow morning at 4.30 a.m. with your updated forecast. Uh, next couple of days looking pretty good outside of the fog early tomorrow morning. All right, Tony, mm -hmm. thanks.